I think we mentioned it on the podcast before that's, that like the penetration of iPhones in people under the age of 25 in America is something absurd, like 80%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, they've won that war. And they've won it not entirely, but largely on the basis of the blue bubble, green bubble war. Yeah. Now, obviously, we're referring to on iPhones. If someone who doesn't have an iPhone sends you a message, it comes through with a green text bubble. As opposed to someone who has an iPhone, it's blue. The issue is less so much like that stupid meme. It's that group chats get broken. Yeah, you you can't really have a group chat with the green bubbles on iMessage. You can't really have a group chat uh, where everyone's using the green bubbles and are going through the regular text message standards. And one of the reasons is quite deliberately, I think, on Apple's part, they didn't adopt the newer standards for regular text messages. Because obviously when you send an iMessage, it goes through the internet, it goes through Apple's servers, it's end-to-end encrypted via Apple's servers. The text, the data goes via the internet. Exactly, and like, yeah. It still blows my mind that the cell towers were set up for phone calls. Yeah. And it was incredible. You know, we had these phones with antennas on them. You could get on the blower with anyone in the world. You could give them a call. And you know, sometimes it would ring out, sometimes it would go to voicemail. The, the system was not set up for text. They kind of it was geniusly worked out a way to send small pieces of data over uh, telephone satellites and telephone lines. Yep. Um, and that's how text was sent. Hence why, still to this day, if you send from an Android to an iPhone, for example, a video... It will look worse. It, like what? How many? Mega, we're talking like 0.6 of a megapixel. Yeah, they. they, they it get, is squares. They it's com- a down round logo. They compress it to like four squares, and you have to sort of figure it out. Or like, whenever the iPhone receives a a very very low res image, it just renders it as like a tiny little. The tiniest thing you'll ever see. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Microscopic. You need to get out like a magnifying glass to have a look. Not a digital one. A legit one. I have one of them. Yep. And uh, let's be real, a lot of this is because Apple loves the fact that there is kind of like a difference between iMessaging between iPhones and getting a message from the leper colony in Android. I think there is a fine line that is walked here. Yeah. So let's talk about what happened and then I'll, you know, I'll, I'll go off. Yeah. Spoiler alert, this restriction is lifting and then to a certain extent, Android users can't use it iMessage and all the stuff that comes with iMessage, but Apple is adopting RCS, which is the latest sort of text messaging standard. Which it's an will, interoperable, like digital text messaging which, standard. Which I've been a holdout on for a while. And what that basically means is that you'll be able to have group chats with your Android friends. They'll be able to send you videos and have them not be compressed. So in a way, it's not going to be exactly the same as two iPhones messaging each other. But it'll be a much better experience. Yeah, and, and supposedly group chats won't just fucking break when yeah. there's like an Android users and iPhone users in there. You won't miss text. And yeah, videos won't look like utter dog shit and images and stuff will come through not like literally totally smaller yeah. than my pinky nail. So people kind of say, and I, and I understand like that's the perspective that like it's a big benefit to Apple having this lock in. But the fact of the matter is it's, it's only the United States where iMessage is so friggin' dominant and has such a massive market share. I really do feel like if I'm a normie, if I'm a normal phone user, if I have a phone and I use it. I'm there. I, I don't give know who Sam Altman is. Yep. I don't know what Grok is. No. If someone explained it to me, I'd get mad at them. Exactly. For being a loser. I don't know what the fucking FTX is. I don't know who Sam Bankman Freed is. I, I do I do dabble in crypto. I do dabble in crypto. That's only because the guy at the pub told me that it was I would you know, it was guaranteed rocket to success. Yeah, exactly. I definitely and I play Rocket League for that matter. I watch I I consume a huge amount of pornography on my phone. <laughs> yes. Like unbelievable amount of it. But That's, other than that, I hate computers. Exactly. Um, like when I and I have an iPhone or whatever, if I have an iPhone and someone sends me a video and it's fucked and it looks like shit, I'm like, and and I say the video you sent me looks like shit, and they say it looks fine on my phone. I think my phone is fucked. If I'm in a group chat with three, if I expect to send a message to a group chat and like I don't get a message and it means that I'm late for something or I didn't understand something, I don't go like, mm, that's because my friend uses an Android phone and it. 
you know, they should really get an iPhone and be really cool like me. I think it just feels like shit. If you're like, you know, a 60 year old and you're trying to send messages around your family and shit's getting lost and looks like crap and you want to see pictures of your granddaughter, um, then you're not like, ha ha, it's because I am an, the ultimate iPhone user and you are just a plebeian Android user. You're like, my phone is fucked. What? And you call your grandson and you yep. say, please fix my phone. If you're listening to this, did you know there's another world out there where you get a second episode of Down Round a week? Yep, it's called Down Round Premium. That's right, and there's no interruptions. No interruptions, no ads, two episodes a week, including the free one you're getting right now, plus another one. Yep, seven bucks a month, not a week, a month, downround.net. Downround.net, instant access to the whole back catalogue as well. You've got so much to catch up on. There's so much. Get around it. Mmm. <laughs> 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 <laughs>